Nityanandam, with the blessings of His Holiness Paramahamsa Nityananda Swami, or Swamiji, I make this video today about the completion process. Now, the science of completion is a technique that um, Swamiji has created and has uh, shared with the world. And so many people have benefited with um, doing this process. You know, I have myself immensely benefited from doing the science of completion process. It's a five-step process that um, involves you uh, looking in and discovering your root patterns and then completing with them. It's a very, very beautiful process. And what I find is when I, you know, doing the process myself or talking to people, I have to say one thing, Swamiji has talked about completion for the past four years, if not longer, so many times. I mean, there was, there's been innumerable amount of satsangs where Swamiji's um, talks about the completion process and the importance of it in different ways completion helps or what completion means how to be complete instant completion doing this uh, SDK process or the five step process or just your decision or just being in the space of Shaktipada or manifesting powers yes there are many ways to reach completion if, and you may think if my pure decision can reach me to completion then what for do I need to process? Well, I think it's pretty black and white. If you decided and you are achieve the completion by the decision, then yeah, you don't need anything else. But if something is still going on, if that pattern still keeps creeping up, um, you still find yourself in the same situation, then more completion is required. And you'll see that the process is very simple. Like if you look at it, you'll be like, oh, it's, it's so straightforward. But then why am I not necessarily feeling I completed? Because this has my, been my, my experience. It's many times our looking in is very um, surface level, unfortunately. We look in, but we don't like what we see. So we retract. We don't really push into the core that's happening inside of us because naturally that's the whole thing we were trying to avoid and got into incompletion in the first place. So then when you're asked to look in, the, the knee-jerk reaction or the, the, the pattern on top of the pattern is that you don't want to look in because you'll be facing what you have pigeonholed as painful or sad or things that make you uncomfortable or angry. And who wants to look in at that? And that's where the role of Swamiji, the master, the guru comes in. Because it's like when you, if you have any children, or they're going through something, it's much easier for them to go through it if they have the support of the parents. Knowing that mom and dad are in the house when something is happening makes the child feel a lot better. Knowing that mom is holding them when they're upset makes the child feel a lot better. And that's where Swamiji comes in. Other than just creating this process, and other than inspiring us to do the process, he is literally with you during the completion process. You are not doing it alone. Your, all your patterns may make you feel like you're alone or sad or upset. And there may be things that you don't want to share with anyone or you've been kept bottled up, or you've just neglected, or you very surface level looked at it. But when you know Swamiji, Swamiji is there with you, it gives you the confidence and security to sit down and do the process and be done with it. And that's what I found really has made the difference in the process. When I remember that, okay, I'm going to look at this pattern. I don't like it. I don't like that it's been there. I don't like that it's caused this in my life. I don't like it that it keeps reflecting in my life. But Swamiji will be with me when I go through the process. Swamiji will take care. So just knowing that Swamiji is with you when you're doing the process makes the process so effective and gives you the results that you would expect from the completion process. 
So I highly encourage you if when you're doing the completion process, have Swamiji's um, photo, Atmamurti if you have, have the mala, be in a place with, um, you know, where you can do this process without being disturbed and sit with Swamiji and do the process. Know he's holding you, holding you, holding your space. So when you are going through these, um, reliving these um, memories or whatnot, he's with you. That will give you the, the support and confidence to just glide through. So nothing can happen. If Swamiji is with you, what can happen? Only thing will happen is that you'll discover your incompletion and have more intelligence about yourself and drop the completion. So it's a win-win situation. And you'll feel so connected to Swamiji during the process and so grateful after the process. So that's my, what my one, one, one of the advices on the completion process. I'm going to share some other personal experiences on how um, completion has helped me and how uh, to do the process where it gives the results um, that we're all looking for. So the, the essence of today's video is remember that you're not alone when you're doing the completion process. You're not alone when you're reliving the memory. Swamiji is with you. He will guide you and be there with you and take you towards completion. You just have to be available, sit and do the process. It's all. That's all. So don't complicate it anymore. There's, there is no memory or no situation which you can't go past. But Swamiji cannot handle it. Swamiji not, cannot make, give you a breakthrough. So with that confidence, um, do the completion process and um, see the miracle, see the breakthrough, see the, the, the relief and joy that comes from it. You will feel different after doing the completion process. So, I think this is like not a secret, but it's it's the, the key to having a successful um, completion process. So, thank you for allowing me to share, and hopefully, you will sincerely uh, do the completion process and um, tell me how it went, and uh, if you have any questions on it, happy, I'm happy to share. And I'll, um, do, I have a playlist on the science of completion, so please check that out, where Swamiji talks about completion in so many dimensions. Um, so thank you so much again, and Nityanandam.